Hey guys, what's up? Welcome. This is uh, Mike and this is Brownie. The Full Metal Alchemist movie dropped about two. Um, the 19th. Yeah, about 19th. Uh, today's 22nd. And, of um, February. You saw it before me. I just watched it about, like 15 minutes ago. Of course, we all know whenever they announce a anime live action, everybody uh, is like, sigh. Yeah, everybody's like, oh god, like, no. It's like not again. Ever since Dragon Ball Evolution, it's just, been like that. <laughs> no. We already went there. We already went there. We're not gonna talk about that. Talking about Full Metal Alchemist. Um, I'm a big fan of the the manga, and I'm a big fan of the um the show yeah, when it dude. dropped on Toonami. Those Toonami days, late night. Yeah, that was like the Adult Swim on Saturdays. Oh yeah. That was that Adult Swim block. Yeah. Yeah, I definitely. remember that. Yeah, I, I remember reading. I actually watched the very first um anime before Brotherhood and all that kind of stuff. So I watched the first one. It was actually a video game too that I had liked. I had loved this anime. Like I was a huge fan. This is on like the level of, you know how I love Ronin Kenshin? Yeah. This is that level. So this, so in other words, like I'm familiar with it. You're familiar with it. Mm -hmm. You're a big fan. I enjoyed it too. I'm a big mm -hmm. fan of it. So let's see, did they fuck it up? Darian, what do you think? Did they fuck it up? You want to love it, but you want to really fucking bash it. At the same time. Yeah, this is true. I'm gonna say the way it started, it started well. It kinda, it's kinda a little sloppy with the uh... With <laughs> you mean like the One Piece music and then it was like, it felt like a serious scene. Yeah. That was supposed to be a serious scene. Like we knew it was a, oh, a serious scene. Oh, by the scene. way, sorry, spoilers. Yeah, oh yeah. Actually, we're not spoiling it. Cause it was like one of the main scenes. It was the first scene that everybody knows from both anime exactly. and manga. So it's kinda like, it should've been serious, but it was like jokey and all that kind of stuff. Exactly. I didn't like it. Uh, the actors, the actresses, they all play their parts kind of okay. The guy that played Eric, Eric, Edward, sorry. <laughs> Where are you, buddy? I don't know. I'm, it's late, I'm tired. I just watched this movie. Hey, that's another thing. This movie was two hours and 15 minutes. Like, I felt that at one point I was just like, you saw me when I was watching. I was just yeah. on my phone. I was like, it dragged. All it, right. It was oh, hard. oh, they're up to that part. Okay, wait a minute. They did that differently. Mm -hmm. I did, they didn't do it like that in the show, okay. Yeah. And like, it's just watched, a lot of moments this is gonna be like that, you know? Yeah, I actually watched the movie in two different parts. I watched it, like, all the way up till Hughes died. Mm -hmm. I took a nap, then I finished it <laughs> later at night. Yo, my man had to take a nap. Yo, my the man. movie, it was way too much like... <laughs> Yo, you took an intermission. I had to take an intermission, yeah. Because <laughs> the right where, like, Hughes died, yeah. spoiler, like, that was the one hour mark. That's like, okay, like, this is season one, let's go to season two, right. and then, like, if there's a sequel, it'll be season three right. and four. So far, I mean, like, the CG was hor horrendous. Horrendous. I mean, like, there was, okay, let me, now, I just saw the movie. I'm trying to think back when the CG wasn't good. Yeah, it wasn't good. I mean, when the CG was, was good. good. I'm sorry. No, Ow. It, Ow. it wasn't. Ow. Ow he was, was the I mean, like, he was the best. I, you know, you know what's funny when it comes. I feel like when it comes to the budget, it went to him. It went all to Al because yeah. he looked good when compared it came to, to CG wise else. compared to everything else. Everything it's just it, it's it's a it's a fucking cartoon. Like yeah, it, it's just it was just bad. But um, <sighs> the Nina? wigs. Let's get How to the wigs. Nina, no Nina. Nina. Oh my god. god. They look like it look it looked like a combination of um of Muppet. Of a Muppet <laughs> and CG. Yeah. That's the best yeah. way to describe it. I mean, like, I did not get that emotion that I got before when I was watching the anime. Because you were criticizing it. Because I was, I mean, like, yeah, but at yeah. the same time, like, and I knew it was coming. Yeah. You see how, like, we're bringing out these really, like, cool highlight parts of the movie? Yeah. That's what's cool about the movie. Like, you know how I just, we yeah, just they said, did like, you want to bash it, but you want to love it? Yeah. I love it because it really brought out, like, a lot of memorable scenes from the anime. Oh, yeah, definitely. Like, you know, Hughes. Nina, Tucker, all that kind of stuff. Yeah. Although they missed out certain people like Scar, where it was like... Yeah, wh where the fuck was Scar? Donde esta Scar? <laughs> <laughs> okay. Subtitles. Let's talk about these wigs. I mean, once you get past... I mean, like, once you get past the cost, The costumes were great. The yeah. costumes looked amazing. They were wonderful. They were, they were amazing. This wig this kid got on? I, is yeah. it a wig? The he dye his hair? What's nah. going on? It's oh, boy, wig. it was a wig. It's horrible. It was, it was a so, wig. It was bad. When it came down to the costumes, everybody, everybody's wardrobe was too, like, pulled straight yeah. out of the manga. To the T. Every happened, detail. What happened with Winry? Every single person, they made Winry into, like, a schoolgirl. Now, and, and I don't want you guys to think, like, oh, you just want, like, the sexy Winry with the mm. halter top. No, 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 no. Like, 
this Winry in this movie, she looks like a school girl. She's wearing yeah. school, and they had multiple like costume changes with her. I think she's the only one who had multiple costume changes. Yes. Yeah. But well, what, what I'm trying to get at is that I want the bandana, I want the gloves, I want the baggy, you know, things. It doesn't have to be a halt the top, it could no. be a regular black shirt, but I want her to look like a mechanic, because that's what she is. Exactly. And they didn't do that. I mean, like, they had that get one mad scene at me for with that, the wrench. but that's pretty the much it. The one scene with the wrench. Exactly. I want to see her knocking people out with wrenches well, like, and stuff. At least, like, they should have had an intimate scene, like, if they want to build a movie between Win Winry and Ed. Yeah. Like, she was supposed to fix his arm. That was one of the really like key scenes. Like exactly. they were talking, and they, he was she was fixing his arm and mm -hmm. everything like that. And I was like, why? Why not show these important scenes where it builds character like that? Exactly. And then it builds another character. My favorite scene in the entire series. They kind of, they kind of like. They didn't dumb it down, they just made it a little less epic. Yeah, but they made it the climax of this movie. They did make it the climax of this movie, is when Mustang goes mother effing ham on lust like this, and he's just uh, 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 uh. <laughs> Oh, you don't know what I'm gonna do this, to this in post. <laughs> that was my, I love that scene in the main, and not the manga, but in the end. In the anime, yeah. No, the day. It, hap it happened, but not like, you know. Yeah, it wasn't as epic. How do you feel about the guy that played Mustang? I love him. Yeah, he was good. He was, he was good. No, good. he really had like, he, he had the look of a badass dude, and then he also had a look of a, a average looking dude that's like human still. Yeah. Which Roy Perfect. Did. Yeah. And oh, by the way, also, let's get to the characters. Um, Edward, he was good. Uh, Winry, she was all right. The guy, oh, that right. Played, the guy that played Al, the voice acting, that's the only thing we could pretty much say. It's very good. If there Mustang, was like, yeah. Mustang was good. Hughes. Oh, spot on. Dude, spot on. this is Hughes. The actor, that's, that's him. Mm -hmm. That was him. Perfect. Yeah, imagine they were probably in the studio like, hey, did someone had just recently become a dad or something like that? We need this raw emotion of <laughs> exactly. like this kind of character. And they found this dude. Yeah. And it was great. Hughes was my favorite character probably of that. Yeah. They had um, certain like side characters. They had gluttony. Well, not side characters. The humunculus or whatever. Um, gluttony. I, I feel like the people that played the humunculus were, were good. Lust, envy, and mm -hmm. gluttony. Very good. Yo, that's CGI on gluttony though. Bruh. Yo, that the back scene, like certain scenes, they should have just been like, nah, B, I'm cutting it. <laughs> <laughs> like this, it should have ended up on the cutting room floor. Like, I mean, like no. they leave, and then also, I mean, like they leave room for a sequel, of course. Would you want to see a sequel out of this? Yes, because they kind of left it, and they did leave it on a cliffhanger. By the way, there is a stinger scene. Mm -hmm. You didn't know this. I didn't know. He it. saw this before, before me. him. And. I'm watching, and then he ha he sees me fast forwarding through the credits. I'm ashamed. And he's like, "What, Mike? What are you doing?" I was like, "I'm looking for a stinger scene." He was like, "I don't know. They don't do stinger scenes." And look, there was a stinger scene. He was like, "Oh crap!" And it's a stinger scene that actually leaves it on the good yeah. cliffhanger for opening for a sequel. I really didn't think the movie was gonna like. I thought that ending was bad until I saw that scene. Right. And I was like, "All right, now it all makes complete sense. Exactly. I'm ready for the second one. Just please get like a Ghost in the Shell budget, and." Fix this. Um, overall, let's get to it. What, what I mean, like, what do you grade mm. this movie? What do you grade this movie? Mm, I mean, five, because it could go really bad and it could go really good. I'm gonna give it a six. Just yeah. because you said five, I'm gonna give it one more point because I want to be the good guy. Oh, okay. Well, yeah, that's fair. <laughs> I mean, it's the same shit. Yeah. Yeah. I but agree. um, yeah, that's pretty much it. That's our Full Metal Alchemist Netflix review. Mm -hmm. Hope you guys enjoyed. Go watch it too. Yeah, wa watch it. It's yeah. it's on Netflix. Who doesn't have Netflix? Unless you're like me. The, the original Netflix holder and then you have like four other people using it. You let that happen? You know who you are. Please check us out. Uh, like, comment, subscribe. Everywhere. Everywhere. Um, all Everywhere. our links on our social media, on our social medias or at the bottom. Please check out our podcast, The Glitch Pit. We try to get that out every week. And that's pretty much it. So, Full Moon Alchemist review. When uh, we're out. Huh? And we're out. What? And we're out. Oh, yeah, we're gone. Later. <laughs>